Hey guys, in this video, I'll be giving my opinion on Fatima the movie. I'm Val Hernandez and this is The Mercy Blog. In this month of October, we are celebrating the apparitions of Our Lady in Fatima, Portugal. So we are inviting you to watch the movie and give us your opinion on it. Now, let's get into the video. Opinion number one. First off, I wanted to applaud all the directors, cast and producers who made a great effort in making this movie. I think they did an outstanding job and it was amazing. This movie did take place in Fatima, Portugal, which gave it its authenticity and made it realistic and true. someone were to say to you why what happened all those years ago had to have happened to you, how would you respond? Because it was necessary. And do you have any regrets? I haven't done enough to please my mother. Which mother? Opinion number two. Now I wanted to talk about the actors. I think that Stephanie Gill, who played the role of Little Lucia, did a stunning job in her accent and clothing, which really portrayed you to the scene. I also think that Jorge Lamelas and Alejandra Howard did a really good job for playing as little kids. I also loved Juana Ribeiro, who played Mary. I think it was beautiful and very well presented. Opinion number three. Something that I did not like about the movie was the angel. In the movie, the angel is represented as female, which angels are spiritual creatures and they don't have a gender. Also, in the scene where the angel appears, it is kind of dark which appears very creepy. And in the actual story of Fatima, the angel appears to all three of the children who is giving them communion, which is something they did not show in the film. What do you want from us? For the gift of I can life, see her now. For the air we breathe. For the it is a sin you're making lies up. It's true, Mama. She was as real as you are. Why would the mother of God choose you? What's so special about you? Opinion number four. I think they did an amazing job at showing the secrets and the miracle of the sun. Something that I did notice was that in the movie, Lucia looks at her mom and she's still completely drenched in water. Now, some of y'all out there who may know the story of Fatima know that after the miracle happened, all this ground and their clothing were completely dry. That is something they did not show in the film, which I understand may be time consuming and a whole lot of hard work, but I think was very important because it was part of the miracle. What harm can three little children possibly do? What is dangerous is what they represent. A huge crowd of people. We need to stop them. We came to see our children. Jump! I want my child is dead! Opinion number five. In the movie, they did show all three secrets. So they showed the vision of hell, which was presented but wasn't too scary. It was important though because our mother did come to the children telling them that there are souls who are going to hell and that penance and praying the rosary is necessary for the conversion of sinners. They also showed secret number two, which was that World War I was going to end but there would be a worse war if they did not do what the lady asked. They also showed the third secret, which was the Bishop of Rome getting killed, which in actual life hasn't been completed to its fullest, but was presented in the movie.
finally, I wanted to close up on the message and the whole point of Our Lady going to the children in Fatima, which is to pray the rosary and do penance for the conversion of sinners, which is something we are called to do in our daily lives. Now, for this video, I want you to go watch the movie and comment down below, tell us what you think of the movie. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video and hit that like button. Don't forget, God is love and rich in mercy. God bless.